Hello and good morning. I am really, really nervous today. I, it's before work, it's really, really early, I haven't slept all night. And the reason why I'm nervous is because I've got to hand in my notice today. I got a job at the end of last week, it's my absolute dream job and it's something that I've been wanting for about, five, well, maybe four or five years. There are a few reasons why I'm nervous. The first reason is that my job is really, really competitive against its competitors and when I handed in my notice for my previous company before I joined my current one, they went absolutely ballistic, they treated me really, really nastily. They threatened me, they sent me letters to my home saying they were going to take legal action against me if I took any clients with me. And they said that they would badmouth me across the industry. They said things like, do you know who you've messed with? They said they were even going to call my dad so he could tell me off or something, which of course he wouldn't. So they're a really, really nasty company though. The current company that I work for are really, really lovely and they headhunted me a year and a half ago and I've been so happy there. I've made some amazing friends there. My work colleagues are amazing. I get on with them so well. It's truly the best place to work. I'm not going to... I was headhunted again by another company but for a completely different sector, although within the same industry. So it's not direct competition and it just opens up a lot more doors for my career and for me to move up and although I love the current place I'm working at, it just doesn't, there's nowhere else for me to really go. I feel like I'm really at the maximum of where I could be. Another reason why I'm nervous is because they just won't be expecting it. It's completely out of the blue. I wasn't showing any signs of leaving because up until Thursday of last week, or I got approached at the beginning part of last week and then I got the job on Thursday and until then, or before then, I had no inclination, no thoughts about leaving. Maybe I was going to consider it in a year's time, but certainly no, you know, there, there won't be any signs, so it would be a complete shock to them. I just don't know what to do. I've written my resignation letter. I haven't slept for nights because I feel so bad. I just don't want them to be horrible to me and half of me is saying I'm sure they won't be but the last company was so so vile to me but they were a much more aggressive company than this one. I have to hand in my notice though because I have sent all my forms back for my new job and they will be asking my current employer for a reference and obviously if I don't ask that's going to be a little bit of a shock and even worse. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to email all my all three of my directors because I don't want to single one of them out and ask for a meeting with one of them today. I've got loads and loads of appointments this morning which is the only downside so I'm going to have to wait until after midday when I'm finished with most of my appointments and see if they can meet me. After I tell my directors I'm going to have to tell my work colleagues and one in particular I'm really really nervous about, the guy that I work really closely with because we are so close and we tell each other everything within the work environment and we are close outside of work as friends and I just haven't said a word to him about this so that will be a complete shock to him and we've always joked through tougher times, you know when it's busy in the year that, we'll all, that we promise to tell each other if we're even thinking about leaving. I've written my resignation letter, it's not really, really, I don't want to say not really, really professional, it's not really, really serious, there's a lot of me in it saying how much I loved working there and I don't know, I'm just so nervous. Everyone's telling me I shouldn't be nervous and I was going to leave it until tomorrow but I think I've just got to get out of the way and oh. Right, so I'm going to email my directors now. Right, I've written it. It basically just says, please could I have a meeting with one of you today? I have appointments from now until about 11.30 till 12ish. Thank you. Send. Oh my God, I'm so nervous. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna stop talking because otherwise I'm just gonna ramble and ramble and ramble until I have to leave for work and like, I don't know, half an hour. I don't know what to do. I'll let you all know how it's gone tonight, hopefully I need to just be 
strong and confident. Stop being such a baby. It's fine. It's fine. They'll understand. They'll understand. <laughs> Hello. So it's the end of the day and I've got a smile on my face. I'm not hysterically crying. I handed in my notice this morning to my director. We went for coffee and I just explained everything to her. I explained why I was doing it and how it happened. And she was really nice, so supportive, completely understood it was for my career. And if I was doing the same job at another competitor's, then she might feel differently about it. But she's really happy for me and asked my advice on how we should look for a replacement for me and just for how everyone was getting on. It was just really, really nice. And it wasn't scary at all in the end and completely forgot to bring my notice with me. And she said, that's fine, I can just give it to her tomorrow. And then she let the other directors know and they emailed me saying that they were really sad to hear I was going, but they can see why it's the right move. So I think I just had such a bad experience at my old firm. They're a lot more aggressive, which is why I wanted to leave in the first place because I wanted to be with a different sort of company and they were just really aggressive and real bullies and you know they're now looking like real bullies in the industry as well so I think it just comes to show that if you're working for nice people and if you're leaving because you're happy but you want to further your career or you want to go have a baby or you want to get married or you're moving then your employers will be fine with it but if you're leaving because you're really unhappy and they're not very nice people then I guess that's the moment when to be scared but then you're going so actually really who cares about it in hindsight I don't know why I've lost so much sleep over this I just I, I think it's because I really like everyone and I really respect my directors so I didn't want them to be upset or have any ill feelings against me but you know, the reason why I respect them so much is because they know how to run a good business. So <clears throat> I should have known, but it's just based on my past experience. So that's all done. So now I've got a new job. Whoop.